The Captain Talk Flicks. The Captain Talk Flicks. The Captain Talk Flicks. The Captain Talk Flicks. Movies, TV, sports, flicks. The Captain Talk Flicks. The Captain Talk Flicks. The Captain Talk Flicks. Movies, TV, sports, flicks. Welcome to the Captain Talk Flicks Podcast. I'm your host, the Captain Cortez. And this is where we talk flicks. I welcome the podcast, the podcast with me, the Captain. Talks about movies, TV, sports, flicks. Anything you see in the two-way screen, I like to get on here and give my unique perspective. Because after 44 years of being on planet Earth, I've developed a unique perspective about these movies, TV, sports, and flicks. Let's get on here and tell you about it. Because just maybe, just maybe you care. And according to the stats, looks like you do care. I want to give a big shout out to the countries from around the globe. I've been checking the podcast out. Like I said, uh, all over the place. And hey, Botswana, I did look into your region. It looks like you guys are growing fast. Looks like these guys are doing a lot of building over in Botswana. I heard you guys got cool safaris. I want to see some wild, exotic animals. Botswana is the place to go. I heard you, I heard you got a great safari out there. Growing business, growing everything. Awesome. I'm glad you're checking out the podcast. Maybe someday after the run is over, I can go over there, get some cuisine, and uh, see the safaris over that way, right? Yeah, beautiful land. Awesome. So I appreciate the love. Appreciate the listens. Awesome. So uh, just an FYI, back in the day, I went to school to be a radio DJ, but I never got a job. Maybe I didn't have the willpower. Maybe I didn't have the desire. Maybe I didn't have the aptitude. Even though I did get trained to do it. I don't know what happened. I never became one. But that allowed me to become the greatest podcast in the multiverse. Subject to debate. Could be true. Might not. But since you heard it on the internet and I said it, it must be true, right? Because everything on the internet is right, is true. Correct? Is that correct? Is that what they teach in school and not everything on the internet is true? I don't know. I have been in school for years. But who cares? Doesn't matter. I'm just rambling. Let's get right the podcast. But first, a word from our sponsor. All right, it's too late to get Christmas presents now. If you want to order them on the internet, it's too late. I would send you to the website to go get some Christmas presents because St. Nick is here, blah, blah, blah. But there's like three, four days left. If you order anything on the internet, most likely you are not getting it by Christmas. So if you're trying to get it on the web, your gift, you have failed this Christmas holiday. <laughs> you better go into a real store and get some gifts, right? But um, if you're not concerned about Christmas presents, you just want to find some unique items for yourself or for family, and don't care about the day of Christmas, it's after Christmas, or you get the presents afterwards or whatever, or you just want to buy stuff, you got money, you want to spend it, and you want some unique t-shirts, hats, notebooks, mugs, pillows, air fresheners, Bluetooth players, chocolates, etc., 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 go over the existing fixtures at the store. And you can get some unique stuff. Also, we got face masks and face shields because the road is still going down. So if you need face shields, face masks, we got you covered as well. So go over the existing fictions as a store. I'll put the link below. And yeah, check it out. Show some love. And now let's get on the podcast. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, I sit here in the Midwest of the United States of America, chilling, relaxing. Lounging, we like four days away. Christmas, right? I'm sitting here lounging, relaxing. I'm having a turmeric and ginger root tea right now. My body's feeling right. It's I'm nice and warm with this warm tea. I love teas, baby. Teas are so nice. So I'm just sitting here chilling. A few days off from Christmas. Out here, live my life. Working hard, working man, working hard, doing his thing, taking care of business, get things done. Taking names and taking lists, or I don't know how to say them. Anyways, I'm sorry here doing my thing. We're away from Christmas. And, you know, had some downtime, watched some too. So this week, this week I was on YouTube, just floating around YouTube, looking at the recommendations. And I see this lady on there, and she does unboxing videos, right? I'm like, okay, another unboxing video. This was about some coffee service that, that get coffee through the mail. I was like, okay, I'll check this out. So I watched this unboxing video of this lady, right? 
but this lady does not do your standard buy unboxing video. Her unboxing videos are a little bit different. So the normal unboxing video you'd watch, people would take the box, open it up, get the product out, and review the product. Now this particular lady reviews the boxes the product came in, right? So check it out. She might order something off the internet, and there's a product inside, and she'll, she don't really talk about the product. She talks about the box the product came in. She talks about the marketing and promotional material and the and the, and the, the, the advertisements and everything come in the box. She talks about everything but the product. <laughs> they were fantastic. This lady knows her stuff. I have a strong feeling she went to school for packaging and whatever they call that. I mean, I don't know what the degree is for that, but I know there's a, there's a field, there's a degree you can go into. I knew somebody back in the day that was going to school for that, for packaging. I'll be honest, I laughed when I've heard it back then because I was ignorant. But now in 2020, I'm like, this is awesome. This lady's up here doing YouTube, and I watched a bunch of these videos. She's up there doing videos talking about the box. Like, this is corrugated, corrugated cardboard, and they printed it with this, and they did this kind of print, and it's a blah, blah, dot, and it's folded this way, and she was using terminology that only someone in the field would know. She was an expert about boxes. She was a box expert. I never thought in my life I would see someone do a video that had the expertise of box and be able to break them down so scientifically. But this lady does it. This lady does it. I watched a bunch of these videos of her just breaking down the boxes. This is just telling me all. I learned so much. I didn't know there was so much going on in the box game. There's a lot happening in the box game. A lot of information to be known. We get, we you know, we we order these things from the internet. So we buy things at the store. We open them up, and if you're like me, don't pay any attention to the box. It's kind of like give me my stuff. Give me the stuff out of there. Oh, screw this box. Give me the stuff. There's a whole science and a whole way of life and a whole deal to put these boxes together engineering to to make these boxes so you can get the products you get this microphone i'm talking into you right now came in a box right and it came in a box i remember the box and i'm like man they put a lot of effort and time into making that box so they can present the microphone in a certain way and every product you get is that way and i never really started to think about that until this lady broke down the boxes and when i get done with this podcast I'm about to go watch more of these videos because I find her very interesting. And I wish I could tell you the name of her channel. I can't remember, but I think the videos are like unboxing, unboxing boxes or something. I don't know. I, I, I'm, I do these all by memory, so I can't remember what they're called. But um, if you look up boxing, unboxing videos, I'm sure you can find her somewhere. I'm not sure how I came across her. It's just my recommendations. But it was so interesting. Like, they, like, cause I watched one. I kept watching them. That's how interesting they were. They just, I kept watching them. I said, like, let me see. Let me take this journey with these boxes. And she's doing different products and different stuff and just breaking down the science of boxes. You know, I'm, I'm so ignorant. I just never thought, I never really said the thought about that. I think I'm a very worldly knowing guy. I know a lot of stuff. But as every day passes, like, I just don't know crap. I didn't know there's a whole, whole science behind boxes, right? And you really think about this. Everything you could probably think of, there's a whole probably career path you could take for it, right? There's a whole career path to just that, whatever you might think, right? Pretty soon there'll probably be a career path to podcasting. Maybe I should get involved in that. Maybe I should, maybe I should look to study so I can get into the career path of teaching podcasting, right? I don't, I don't know, but, but everything you can think of, there is a, a science and a study in the scholarly way you can look at these things and boxes are no different and I've, I've never really thought to think about it although I didn't know someone back today was going to school for it I don't know if they ever went to they finished it or not but they told me they're going for packaging and I'll be completely honest with you I did laugh and thought it was kind of funny because I was ignorant and dumb back then <laughs> I was naive and dumb and ignorant and I did think that I, I admit that now it's 2020 that person that did that I hope you're thoroughly thriving and doing well in the world of boxing. If you're still doing it, if you're still doing boxing, it's awesome, man. Because it is impressive the way this lady breaks down the science of boxes, right? Yeah, I, I just, just was so, I was so shocked. And, and, and as soon as I saw those videos, as soon as I saw the lady talking about these boxes, I knew third video, and I was like, yes, I gotta talk about that on the podcast. 
you probably see that I'm easily entertained. I'll watch things that, <laughs> like, I just watch random stuff and keep watching them just to learn from them, right? It might be something just totally weird and, you know, just something really obscure. And I just watch it. It's like, what can I learn from this, right? As I'm, as I'm walking through life these days, whatever whatever it is, with real life, watching the internet stuff or talking to people or or experiencing this, or that, whether it's reality or internet, I'm trying to learn everything I can from every experience, good and bad. I just had some some interesting experiences this past week, and I try to look for the lesson in them. I had quite a few. This whole this week, the last few weeks have been very uh, eventful, and um, I just try to learn from everything that's went down. So it's a lot of things happened. It's just like, oh my God, so much happening. It's the end of the year. But you know, at this time of year, the Christmas time of year, it does seem that for whatever reason, life just seems to be kind of busy this time for for me for, from the last decade. So anyways, I just try to learn from everything and watch these boxing videos is like no other. YouTube, I've said many times, it's great for learning about stuff. If you, if you use it that way, right? And I watch a whole bunch of different stuff. I have no idea how the recommendations figures out what I want to watch because I'm all over the place with what I watch on YouTube. You know, I'm watching boxing videos now. I'm watching yoga pad videos. I'm watching videos on Botswana. Oh yeah, when I said Botswana in the intro, the only reason I know that about Botswana because the one on YouTube and I learned about Botswana, right? And I'm watching all types of stuff. I don't know how they get a, a, a marketing whatever on me because I'm all over the place. I got have all the people on earth. I'm probably one of those dudes like God. I hate this guy for marketing because I cannot figure him out because he watches so much different crap. And this amount, I mean, it's, it's, it's very. I mean, I'm all over the place. It, it, it just everywhere. Just sometimes I just think of something. I go to YouTube just look it up. Just some random crap. <laughs> it's crazy, man. Anyways, uh, so I want to talk about. I just want to talk about how impressed I was from this lady talking about boxes and packaging. It was a breath of fresh air too. It was something new. I've seen a million unboxing videos, and this was like a new spin on. It. I, I I I like I like I like people that that, that they're doing something different. Right? I love different. Doing they, they, okay, things been done a million ways, and this is something different. And I was surprised that the plays in the video were not that high, because she she was she's she's got something there. She's doing really. This she's got like her own thing there. I can't imagine a lot of people out there doing those kind of videos. Maybe they are. I don't know. But she's got her own niche there and much respect from someone that does these podcasts and does them his own way, his own little niche way. Uh, much respect. Captain gives you a salute. Props to you. I, I appreciate the uniqueness that you bring to the YouTube. I appreciate your expertise and the, the engineering of boxes and boxing and all that. Much respect. Awesome. I love the videos. And so, yeah, you should check them out. And unfortunately, I don't have a link right now. And maybe when I when I put this up on SoundCloud, I'll put a link to the videos or to the YouTube channel below. If I can find it. <laughs> I watched all those videos. I should be able to find it. Yeah, so I will put the link below so you can watch these videos. And maybe you'll be as impressed as I was. Or maybe you'll be like, bro, you get, you need to do so you gotta get a life, bro. <laughs> hey, I like what I like. Don't judge me. Anyway, so yeah, so maybe you should watch this boxing video and see her break down the boxes so when you get your presents on Christmas, you can say, oh, that's a corrugated da 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 print box, and it's a da 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 style box, and I know that box is this way, this way, and you can you, and you can impress your family. You're going to open up them boxes on Christmas, and you'll be able to break down the signs of the boxes to your family members who got you the box. So once you open up your present and you get the box, you say, hey, Dad, this box isn't actually blah, 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 blah box, and blah 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 and your parents would be like oh my gosh how did you know that say hey i read a lot <laughs> so anyways oh um, much respect have a happy holiday if you celebrate that and until next time we'll see you. live long and prosper spock until next time it's captain peace the captain, the captain talks, talks, talks. Lit. Lit. Lit.